Another potential problem to the urban trees is vandalism and browsing. Damage may be inflicted on trees simply out of intent to destroy, out of casual disregard, as a consequence of harvesting tree products and by browsing livestock. In the pictures, we can see the first picture, the trees being cut inappropriately, maybe due to the intent to destroy or out of casual disrespect. Same to the second picture, showing that it is crafted with words and shapes and icons. The last picture showing the squirrel. The squirrel is damaging the trees by eating the tree's bark. The next potential problem of urban forest is the unorganized waste disposal. Rather than being a means of recycling urban waste, Urban forests may be used as dumping grounds in manner that is wholly deleterious to the environment. The next potential problem of urban forests is the unorganized waste disposal. Rather than being a means of recycling urban waste, urban forests may be used as dumping grounds in manner that is wholly deleterious to the environment. To irresponsible people, illegal dumping ground means shortcut to waste disposal. There are many cases illegal dumping ground have been reported. In the diagram, we can see a root site being an illegal dumping ground. In the second picture, it is located in Precinct 20 Putrajaya. Putrajaya is a planned city and the federal administrative center of Malaysian capital, but it is also being the illegal dumping ground. In developing as well as developed countries which receive significant solar radiation, solar power is an increasingly utilized energy source. Due to solar energy needed in cities, many urban trees prune inappropriately or cut down for blocking the solar radiation. This somehow will affect the growth of urban trees. Even though many know the importance of urban trees but they neglected it. 